here comes the flood. Nice shots from Zeldris. And follow from T Dog, but they don't clear out the U Haul corner, and Mata punishes the call. Now on three, looking for more on the side. Zeldris can two spots. At least he got their first here. Well, that's not unfortunate. A little unfortunate. Boombot scouts it out. Nerf finds the kill. Nice shot from Ziff. Opportunity to reclaim the site. Now it's just down to how do you break back the rest of this post plane? Because a lot of it is deeper, and Ziff is just not missing. Fly a last one left could do nothing. And Maybe they get something out of this with modest position. Oh, what a winning trade. Molly comes through. Dizzy also a part of the picture here. Ziff on the way back in. Fly just causing some deterrent. How about this? MXS finding kills. Now a couple of weapons. Gets the halfway off the defusal though. Ziff by himself. 1v2 situation. And he's looking everywhere. He's got no idea where this post plant's truly set up at. Finds the first. Snaps over to the second. Time is going to be tight. Does he get it? No! Oh! I mean, someone I don't know. I like apples. Lost. It's apple season. I don't know. It's not apple season. Yeah. Not going to happen here. As nope. Snarly will give it a go. Dizzy over the top. Wingman on. Wait a second. Pardon? I was saying Wingman nearly got that thing to 75%. Retrigger from Snarly. But like you said, the Molly was already at the ready. Maybe a chance to try to recontest this. Has an isolated 1v1. But Brock just not giving it the time of day. Time to come get an issue again. Vic over the top. Does Wait. get taken down. Wait, does he actually have it this time? Oh, yeah, he does. Oh, okay. Well, okay. Furushima playing it from the palm tree. This time he used both of his stink bikes and force showers so they could actually move up and get all these skills, get super close, give his life away so he gets a pit in the next round, too. <laughs> It'll lead to like an ice cream. <laughs> Orbital Strike tries to clear out showers. This time talking about differentiation of how you open things up. But opening trade does come through Zeldris off the high ground. And how about this? Now you've all of a sudden got a 4v2 in the opposite way. Post plant is able to get established, but the Viper's Pit not in a position to be used to reinforce this. So a very difficult individual status for both MXS post planters. Wait a minute. It's doable. It's doable right now. Fire has ult. This kill is huge. Ah, yeah. oh, not anymore. Yeah. Oh, and the Viper's pit gives away Odishima's position. You space. So there's opportunity here for maybe an advantage to come out. But wow, okay. I'm surprised that this was the call for core. They just try to sneak their way in. Vic gets a freebie. Dizzy over the top kind of, again, just asserts that MXS hold control of the site. Mata is way up in the heavens. Doesn't make a difference. Pinstripe goes the kill feed. Ziff still the, the last one left, and he can do nothing as Vic will find full teleport or commit hardened in sight from the front. And they are, and Zeldrit's already TP'd over there, or should I say satcheled over the cross to break at least the gap that may separate them to plant wow. towards the A site. What a read. Does he get here in time, though, to stop much spike of this post plant? Planted. Wingman will get the spike planted. Snarly oh. working in from spices. Core have cleaned out so much of where this post plant could be. It just comes down to can you win your gunfights? Yes, we're looking right at you, Snarly. Has to come through this flank as the timing there. He may have missed a bit of a window here. Yeah, he gets caught, but T-Dog is holding. And Onishima sneaks past Zeldris, who pushed in towards mid. Oh, it's just like the most catastrophic balance oh timing you've ever seen. But Nerf can hop back on and secure oh the defuse before the orbital strike. Unreal. Or Metallica or something. <laughs> yeah, you're flat out. Here comes that same shower play. The Viper's utility being spent. Oh, Mata across. <laughs> caught himself by surprise. He didn't finish that first elimination, but kill stuff come through. Snarly caught over towards this backside teleporter play, but still comes nice. away with the double. So hold on a second. For a low buy, Core is still fighting here. And they have Shower's Control. They can pinch right now, so it forces MXS to play back towards the spawn. Vic is in a great spot to cover Mata. <laughs> wow. Nice shot from Ziff. Vic. The walking double kill. Standing. Not this time. Just down to Brock. 1v3. Ah, he's giving up his position. Dizzy over the top. Has to make a choice here. T-Dog will hop back on. Have to find these kills and find them quickly, but Snarly foul. Eyes now for round number 12. Look at this, T-Dog creates issues over towards you all. Tries to step in through his own flash. Works out for two. Beautifully done, but the wingman does come out, and the thrash creates a bit of an issue. So MXS tested here in their post point, but providing the eliminations they need, plus a little extra damage off the paint shells. Love the paint shells to get them out of the astral position so that we can actually place some great stars. I mean, it was only able to react off the uh, smoke. Yeah. Messy 1v1 One between Geckos remains. right there. Mata right on top of the spike. No worries for him. Ziff fighting back. 1v1. Hold on a second. He still has, uh, I was going to say, not just. Nope. Right now it's on the back of Nerf, though. So this this might this might be a little bit difficult right now if they're not trying to. Oh, mm, yeah. <laughs> 
Say whatever you want, Van Silly. Sometimes the pistol play 30 seconds shuts us left. off mid-sentence. Yeah. At least Nerve is going to get the plant no matter yep. what. So that, I mean, it was part of the plan. They have the script. Snarly is going to die, so you have to plant no matter what. So they have Nerve going for the plant. And they have oh. a nice crossfire, though, for this push. This is bold. Try to take elbow control away from Mata. Yeah, works out nicely. Ziff over the top sees, I believe, both members move in towards sight off this cross through One Hookah. So now all of a sudden, Core find themselves with the power positions. Brock stuck between a rock, a hard place, and a harder place. This has got three different members to worry about. And of course, he, yeah, I was saying Core needed to use this thrash to try to clear out U Haul and then hopefully use some utility to try to do some contesting over towards the shower side of the site, but. Everything comes through with an opening one for one. Vic goes completely unchecked, but doesn't get the wingman. So the plant comes through, stops this from being around, determined by the game clock. And now we get into a 3v4, pardon me, 3v3, with Core setting up a deep post plant. And thankfully, Brock didn't die from getting detained here. So double push towards you haul Dude. Ooh, Snarly with Guardian there. Again, same spot, right over towards you haul you would think he had a shotgun in hand with how much he's finding, and that's enough for Brock to not even give it a go. Get yourself a little bit of a boost in what's still remaining on a number of players, plus the opportunity for ultimates in the Fobble Brown. Odashima creates a little bit of an issue, plus now this flank for MXS collects not just a kill, but also a weapon to work with, and that's enough for Brock to get out of there and wait for help. VCL Sheris, and yeah, Brock is going to hold it back, and I like it. He's holding elbows. He's gonna get hit by that knife, but it doesn't matter. He doesn't mind fighting very close with the stingers so who can try to take his opponents down, yet they're pitching behind him. Yeah, Brock, if you could go one for one, would be incredible. It does better than that! Oh one my two, goodness! How does he get both? Just straight spam. That's the answer. T Dog in the corner, though. Hold on a second. What He's got Mata isolated. Wingman pushing through. T Dog slips away, but Brock comes upgraded into the Phantom. Five man stack. Here comes the flood. Nice shots from Zeldris. And follow up from T Dog, but they don't clear out the U Haul corner, and Mata punishes the call. Now on three. Looking for more on the side. Zeldris confirms the trade, and that's enough for him to get the showstopper, which he uses to trade on his own life. 1v1. Nerve only has the two stars to play with Flya, a guardian, and nothing else. There's the vacuum. Fly doesn't quite get it all the way to halfway. Second star gets placed. There it is again. Immediately triggered. That's the Nova Pulse that gets spent, though. So Nerve will have to check this. Comes down to time. Fly gets it to halfway, but the peak is perfect from... Again, coming over. Thrash going to be denied immediately. Molly also possesses in the middle of the map, plus the spam. Enough for Vic to tally the first blood for free. Hit towards Shower, still developing. Yeah, it just kind of feels like one of those moments where you're really just trying to force it in. Although, nice little crossing angle from Snarly. Huge flank. Does limit the numbers to a 3v3, but Odashima's flank is about to ruin everything. And that's exactly what he'll do. And a change of pace for MXS2. Adding a flanker on top of that, knowing that they're playing against a non sentinel comp. And that was something that didn't happen too much, right? Zeldras did it once only on defensive. Bit of a luxury item here of a free hookah play. So here comes the push on through. Crossfire set up. And wow, nice transfer from Flya. He's going to take no. down three. Plus the Viper's Pit really is going to get much. The Rockets from Mata will connect. And Snarl has got nowhere to go. Flaw. I mean, the thing about it is this fake doesn't really get much. Counter nope. utility, and yeah, T Dog just has to force something, trying to clear out Hookah desperately. That doesn't work. Paint shells over the top. Fly uh, steps away from it, but then loses the backside of the site, meaning that Fly has to come back out. And as he does, he finds himself too. Unreal play from Fly. Uh, you thought Core maybe had something to work with, but now. Dude, so, really, kitchen sink now. Oh, has this been seen? Uh oh, uh oh, not the cleanest moment from Zeldris, and that does allow an opportunity for trades to eventually favor MXS. Brock still inside the site will help put everything to rest. I'm telling you, this was like the wildest first like 20 